The next time you go to the ballpark, you might be singing some different lyrics to take me out to the ball game. <laughs> After over a hundred years of selling its caramel popcorn snack under the name Cracker Jack, parent company Frito Lay announced today that it would be rebranded as Cracker Jill. Joining us to share the reasons for these exciting new changes is Frito Lay PR representative Earthskin Joster. Earthskin. In these changing times, we're moving forward into a gender inclusive and gender affirming landscape. We really want our product names to reflect our values as both a major corporation and the final arbiter of all morality. Amazing. <laughs> I think. All right, got it. So, I just got off the phone with corporate, and it seems like we're actually going in a slightly different direction. It's been brought to our attention that the term cracker may be perceived as a pejorative, and as such, we will now be going forward with a new name, Caucasian Jill. Well, the fact that you're able to uh, make these changes, despite already spending 20 million on advertising, shows your commitment to staying on the right side of history. Oh, <laughs> we, we think that- All right, yeah. Yeah, I got it. Okay, so we ran it by a study group and they all pointed out that Caucasian has the word Asian right in there and we cannot appropriate. So we're gonna take out the Asian and we're just gonna call it, you know what, we're just gonna call it White Jill. Wow, what a name. I'm sure little white girls everywhere are going to- You guys to sure about this one? All right, love you, bye. Okay, so we feel that Jill is a little too specific and exclusionary. We really want to empower all women, trans women and we'll mix in and just women, real women. So we're substituting in the word power to represent the strength of we'll mix in hood. Our new name is gonna be White Pop. Okay, now it's Popcorn Puffs. White Trash Treasure Mateys. Oh, sorry, scratch that. Crack a lackin' snack attackin', Crangy's McBasketball, Honky Delights, Kringleberry Confectionaries, <laughs> Hillbilly like Chips, <laughs> Redneck Snack Crack is Whack, Crack is Cheap Mix. Uh, okay, final answer, we are going with sugar, corn, syrup, popcorn, peanuts, molasses, salt, corn, and or soybean oil and soy lecithin snack. Well, there you have it. That is a name that does use words to describe the ingredients in the snack. In other news, Twitter employees worry that new board member Elon Musk will turn their free speech platform into a platform that allows free speech. <laughs> hmm. Ploppy jalopies, popcorn for pale faces, mailman munchies, gringo granules, Yankee doodle dundies, the master snack. Howley Hurricane, Caramel Karen Crunchies, QAnon Crisps, Confederate Corn, I Have a Black Friend Tastios, Oops, All Aryans. Did you just watch a video from the Babylon Bee? Then you are part of the problem. I'll bet you're gonna like, comment, subscribe, and hit that little bell button too, aren't you? You are a cisgendered, heteronormative aggressor. You are perpetuating problematic, toxic ideas of Anglo-normativity. 